Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello Halal family, welcome to the channel I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful uh, day In today's video we'll be reacting to a Malay Kong Pong in Kataning, Western Australia This video was suggested by brother uh, Muhammad As well as Azir Q Thank you very much for taking the time to send me Your recommendation and suggestions Stay tuned guys, we'll be right back with a video Welcome back guys, inshallah we're going to get started with the video momentarily and at the end of the video I'll be sharing with you my observation and reaction so please make sure you stay until the end. With that said, we're going to get started with the video. On first glance, this might look like any other town but drive by this man, this hotel and this mosque and with some luck, you might find yourself at the scene of a Malay kampong wedding. Wait, but aren't we in Australia? Yes, we are. Even though we live in Australia and our culture is not lost, we still preserve you know, our identity as a Malay. Nama saya Alep Maidi. Saya adalah seorang imam di Masjid Kitaning dan saya mempunyai coffee shop di Kitaning. The population of Kitaning is just 4,500. This of 400 are, are the Muslim Malay that lives here. We are a minority in Australia. It doesn't mean that we can't be part of it. Why can't we blend together in Malay culture? Malay wedding is nothing small. If there's a wedding, the whole town knows the wedding. Everybody help one another. Gotong Rowing is about helping each other. It's always that togetherness. It's part of the, the, our culture of, as a Malay. It's like an you know, old ways of traditional Malay kampong. The washing, the cutting of the meat, the, the vegetables, the cooking. We're all pitching together. Just because we are in Australia, in a uh, European culture, it doesn't mean that we can't, we can't be part of it. When we first arrived in the 70s, people called us so many names. Choco, Choco Boys, Sembo, because of our colours, brown skin. From the cafe, I opened up the called integrations between the two cultures. It integrated um, the Muslim and the non-Muslim. You know who buys the cinema? Orang Putih. Well. My main clientele are non-Malays, <laughs> but not just an ordinary people that come to the shop. Ministers from churches, padres, priests, they all come for a meeting at my, my cafe. Because I accept regardless what nationality, what colour you are, what religion. And to me, they are my guests and I have to treat them well, with respect. True kindness and caring and listening. Sometimes when I listen to my customers, I feel sleepy. I because I've been in the shop from 5 o'clock in the morning but I need I open my eyes and open my eyes just for them. It has done so much. I have built the bridge. So people ask you questions about Islam, about your culture. You know, as long as we all accept who we are and know where we come from, in any way you go, don't forget who you are. A Malay without identity, you can't. You became what? Nothing. So that's really, really nice. Um, in Australia, there's, I guess, a little bit of uh, the Western Australia. There's a part where that's uh, there's lots of uh, Malays that uh, reside there, which is really, really cool to see. Like you said, he's just bridging that gap between uh, Muslims and, and non-Muslims, right? It's a perfect uh, thing to do, especially nowadays and, and what's going on uh, around the world. We need to have a better understanding between different cultures, different religions and religions and different ethnicities. So um, that's uh, awesome to see. And actually that uh, food that they're preparing, oh, it looked delicious and um, made me super, super hungry. <laughs> so thank you very much guys for suggesting it. I hope you guys liked it too. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And if you'd like me to react to another video, please put in the comment section below. Hello, as always, guys, thank you very much for your love and support. I hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day. Take care of yourself and your family. And inshallah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.